We have new info tonight about the man busted for taking more than a thousand videos of women trying on clothes at Mid Rivers Mall. Charles Schultz has been charged with invasion of privacy. And investigators say he didn't just target shoppers, he also went after mall employees. Five in your side's Jenna Barnes is live from Mid Rivers Mall where she's been talking with female customers. Jenna. Yeah, and then the women I talked here talked to here tonight say they are beyond disgusted by this case and they're shocked that this guy was able to get away with this for an entire year. Women at Mid Rivers Mall were clueless. A man was recording videos up their skirts and in fitting rooms while they were undressing. Just a huge violation. Jamie Ward was here just a couple of weeks ago trying on swimsuits. It makes me feel like super creepy, creepy that this has been going on here. Police say several times between February 2017 and February 2018, Charles Schultz tied his phone to his shoelaces and he followed employees in the mall asking about merchandise while secretly recording up their skirts. He also captured customers changing in the fitting rooms, a place shoppers say they normally feel safe. There's like a few other customers or some store associates walking around. You would never think that you know, someone is like back there with with something in their shoe trying to, you know, just be voyeuristic and, and prey on other people. Police were tipped off when two women spotted Schultz in the act last December. Officers say he confessed and when they searched his computer, they found nearly 1600 video files. 120 of those videos were of women in fitting rooms, nude or partially nude. It's going to make you really stop and think when, to look around when you're in a fitting room. You know, and, and even look, I mean, you'd usually, you'd want to look for cameras above or something, but I wouldn't have thought to look that somebody's sticking their foot under the door. And the shoppers we met say this case makes them want to do more to protect themselves. I'm going to be more aware of my surroundings. And tonight I called the spokeswoman for Mid Rivers Mall to ask if they're going to be changing any of their security policies because of this case. I'm still waiting on a call back with that answer. Live in St. Peter's, Jenna Barnes, five on your side. Unbelievable story, Jenna, thank you.